Environmental protection is very important to crampets. That is why we only use Class 1 leak detectors in our containers, the best in the business, the so-called vacuum leak detector. And this is how it works. The tanks are constructed with a double wall, a second wall, a second tank filled with the fluid is welded behind the outer wall at a small distance inside. This creates a monitoring room between inner and outer wall, which is controlled by the leak detector. In the leak detector are located a vacuum pump and a measuring unit for vacuum control, shown here with a manometer. Air from the monitoring room is withdrawn through the suction pipe and directed via the exhaust pipe into the tank. In the event of a leak, this prevents explosive gases in the suction pipe from escaping to the outside. The suction pipe runs down to the bottom of the monitoring room. By operating the leak detector, the vacuum pump starts. The air in the monitoring room is withdrawn completely. This forms a vacuum. Negative pressure, the vacuum, is continually checked by the measuring pipe. The vacuum pump starts every now and then in order to keep the vacuum constant. This is necessary as a small drop in pressure in the vacuum system cannot be avoided over a longer time period. If there is a leak in the tank, the negative pressure drops rapidly and can also no longer be sustained by the pump. If the critical limit is reached, the leak detector triggers an alarm. This happens if the outer shell breaks. But what if there is a leak in the inner tank? The fluid reaches via the suction pipe the liquid barrier. This stops the inflow and the suction pipe is closed. The vacuum pump can no longer generate a vacuum. The negative pressure drops and the alarm is triggered. Here too, the leak is indicated within a very short time. This makes the system 100% secure. Thanks to the vacuum leak detector that monitors the inner and outer shell at the same time, fluid can never leak unnoticed. Security through technology. Crampets tank system. Cubically good.